This is Sandra 73. I've always wondered if the films I make really make a difference. I had gone to Guatemala to make a documentary, but I had no idea I would be filming in the middle of a genocide. Mountaintop removal is when you take the top of a mountain and then you have a level area. Right now you're trespassing. You're trespassing on us every day. Dust and your camels is... It's disgusting. Writing is like a disease. It steals your body from you. William Burroughs was alien to many people, and it's only an alien that would write about Western culture like he did in Naked Lunch. People often come in here and get lost, and I imagine that they got constipated or something, but they get fascinated with these pictures. The pencil and the paper makes me think better. It probably helps me like an aspirin. <laughs> you know, there's an element of self-awareness in all this. Know your limits. Push right up against them, of course, but don't do anything foolish. Every dead bird at Midway has plastic in them. I was a captain of the cheerleading squad in high school. The universe wanted me to be a roller girl. I obliged it. It feels a little bit like I'm a dead woman walking. With Death with Dignity, you do have some control without being focused on when she's going to die. If Skid Row is a step away from the pits of hell, then thank God I'm not in hell. They call me Sandman the Rapping Cowboy. Does anybody out there remember the song, Rapper's Delight? And we got turntables out here, you know? If you've never heard it, it's pretty, pretty neat. Maybe I'd made a mistake to take this elephant's life and merge it with mine. It was such a symbiotic mutual love, it defies description. Pictures of garbage at 10,000 pounds, at 12,000 pounds, with 20,000, at 25,000, at 28,000 pounds. One of the most publicized of the underground films is by pop artist Andy Warhol. Andy, is there anything special you're trying to say in these films? Um, no. The camera has a motor and you just turn it on and you just walk away. 